Hey guys, and welcome to VW Farm. I'm Darren, and today we're going to Volks Power, which is at Red Car Rugby Club. So, we'll see you when we get there. So we're here now, and we're going to take our drone up for an aerial view, then have a walk around and see what cars are here today. So the first thing we've spotted is a barger. Some uh, right bumpers on it, there's two actually, dead similar. I've noticed the lights got no chrome bezel to make it look a lot meaner. Let's have a look around the back. It's always showing the engine. Very nice car. The condition of that paint works lovely. All new interior. That is very nice. So this car's had a body off restoration. Yeah, love all the chrome bits that he's uh, done to it. Even in the, in the window, all back to the original style. And it's got two sets of wing mirrors. Make sure I don't have a bump. So it's had a new bulkhead, new floor pans. It's got turquoise L380 is the colour. And it's had probably hours and hours of time spent on that car. Getting it to that condition. Then we've got a Mark 1 Golf. And another Beetle. With the sloping headlights at the front. <coughs> Some Porsche seats. They're not Beetle seats, like bucket seats. This is a 1300. It's a nice engine, it's got the uh, different kit on the on the engine for the fan and the alternator. Well, that's a dynamo, I think, that one. We're at this Beetle, which is a 1965. It's actually 57 years old. Still drivable. And it's in pearl white, which is the same year and colour that we're actually doing our car. This is done to a lovely standard. I mean, it's absolutely immaculate. It's got all the proper period features, the original deck lid and the crept back lights and a lovely looking engine. And I, I like this bumper with the extra extra bumper added on to save your tailpipes when you're reversing. So we have this bay window called Madge with its pop top roof. Oh I know you. Hello. Oh sorry. Yes, you don't know me. No, no. <laughs> well, 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 it's, uh, it's YouTube. Yes, yes, I'm uh, quite an avid butcher. Yeah, well. <laughs> so looking at this beetle, it's it obviously on airbags, it's really low. But not only that, the roof is also really short. The windows are really, really small. It's got a really nice roll cage in there. But being so low, would it ever roll over? <laughs> so here we have 
as Witter, which actually only produced for six months. The production line on this one was SSU 687. At the rear, actually has a split window. And it's got a lovely engine, looks all original. I've got a feeling this was probably the oldest one, oldest car here today. So that's two cigarette lighter. Oh, cigarette lighter. We don't care, you know, all we all we And you've got your indicators, which is, well, call semaphores that pop out. And then if you're going too fast, we won't go back down. <laughs> <laughs> Slipped up here, haven't we? The original, <laughs> an original fuel gauge. Yeah, take this off, plonk it in and you know how much you've got left. So it's an actual dipstick. So this is a lovely split screen, 23 window with a rag top roof. It's got the Safari front windscreen that pop out and also the pop out windows all the way along, except for the last one, which have got the bit there luggage bars. It's in lovely condition. It's also got them in the windscreen there as well. I didn't put them in now. Everything that you need. You would have been doing now. Oh. Well, lovely looking white beetle here. Looks like it'd be a really good wedding car. And I love the crest on the front of that bonnet. It's got pop out side windows. And it's actually called Charlie with a 1300 engine. And at the side of it is a jet black beetle, which is an oval. And it's got the semaphores. And it, this one's actually left hand drive. With sloping headlights and Porsche alloys. Here we've got a lovely buggy. It's got the disc brakes at the front. It's a right hand drive with a lovely interior. Some large off road tyres. Massive engine. Tell you what, I bet it'd even wheel at this thing. Looks a monster. So we have a couple of bay windows. This one's actually for sale. And also, purple beetle. No worries. the right colour bay window. Definitely eye-catching. So this is a great van. It's actually an HGV. It's an old library. And it's a Ford Ivoco, 10 ton. And you do need an HGV license to drive this. Here we have a 1958 split screen bus. It's got the uh, different pop out windows at the side there. And behind it is actually another one with a similar type of windows. So I've got a feeling they were uh, being fitted after. Maybe they was made as a van. Well, this one's actually from California. Very similar colors to ours. Here we have a lovely bay window with Garfield eyes at the front of it. It's a lovely setup with its pop, pop top roof and a solar panel as well. There was it's a lovely uh, T28 camper van. They're massive alloys, 20 inch. And then here we have a bay window in bright orange. Here 
we have a VW version of the 18 van. It has the wheels, the stripes, and even beer baracus in the window. It's the right idea. It's not exactly a VW, but it's definitely interesting. It's actually a Ford. Get fringe of nails in all 12 minutes. So we have a new Beetle in Ferrari red with Ferrari wheels. The Beetle shop. BW Air Cult Specialist in memory of Wayne Seal. We've well, really enjoyed it here today, so please give us a like and a subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. No.